There are plenty of pilots on Long Island. Bill is one of them. Mm -hmm. Well, tonight we're introducing you to another who goes to great lengths or heights to get the perfect shot for movie directors. News 12 Long Island's Bill Corbell got to spend the day with a guy who has a unique and challenging job. Meet Al Cirillo. You may not recognize his name, but you've probably seen his work. Whether it's a breathtaking aerial view of the New York City skyline, a superhero flying over Manhattan, or halftime at a Super Bowl, when it comes to aerial cinematography, there is no one better than this Long Islander. Approaching 27,000 hours of flight time. Based at Republic Airport, Al is the go-to guy when a TV or a film producer needs a shot of New York City or its surroundings, including Long Island. 1,605 combat hours. Like many pilots of his generation, Al began his career flying combat choppers in Vietnam. A few years after his return to Long Island, he started shooting film from a helicopter and hasn't stopped. His footage has appeared in more than 500 movies, 200 TV shows, and countless commercials. Most of the work is done in an impeccably maintained Twin Star helicopter. So I've been flying this since 1995 and uh, just rebuilt in 2009. It's a 1982 but the only thing that's 82 is the body. One shot that sticks in his mind was for a scene in Home Alone 2. Where Macaulay Culkin was on the deck of the World Trade Center and we flew very close. I could have reached out and shook his hand. When not filming a scene, he often gets into the action himself as a stunt pilot. A good example is the 1985 movie, The Protector. Jackie Chan, where he actually did his own stunt, I yanked him out of that moving speedboat which crashed into the, uh, the cabin cruiser and blew up. Even after 50 years of flying, Al is just as busy as ever, and it never gets old. I just came back from D.C. I just worked on Born 5 and uh, The Purge, okay. and I'm going back to D.C. in two weeks for the new Spider-Man. Another Spider-Man? Yeah. Never, you're big with superheroes. While Al's goal is to always get the perfect shot, there is something else even more important. Safety, it's all about coming home at the end of the night. How he must have stories. He does. Oh, I wish we, we could have done this for an hour. I know. So Absolutely. we have more of the interview on uh, 612. Okay. And click on the extra section there and some more links on the news12.com uh, page as well. And look at my face. He's got a lot of stunt too. stories too because you were telling a story where oh, he's done to climb up. And he's done very dangerous yeah. things. Yeah. Wow. He's, 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 and he, he began in Vietnam and uh, that's where he said he learned how to fly low and fast. Yeah, oh that, yeah. Okay. So, uh, Al, that's by the way, Al will be flying back and forth from Republic to Jones Beach during the air show, shuttling people back and forth. So if you're at Jones ah. Beach, you'll see the blue helicopter. Just wave. Just wave. Yeah. Just wave. <laughs> yeah, how you doing?